My name is Irving Wasserman, and uh, this is Inside Leisure World number 43. But who's counting? <laughs> uh, you know, we, we count these things because one number tells you which show is the next. Well, everything is, is Inside Leisure World. However, uh, we, we will be able to tell which one of the program we're talking about if we number them. So that's the reason we count them. But uh, uh, <laughs> today we have a great guest with us, and uh, <laughs> uh, she's... Uh, She's a problem. That she's somebody you've seen quite a quite a few times. If you've ever seen any of the uh, in the uh, Leisure World Theater Club shows, because she not only acts in them, but she also writes some of the plays, and she's a, a great lady. I'd like to have you uh, see her and meet her with her. This is uh, her name is uh, Florence Roush Ellers. So let's speak with her for a while now. Huh? Hello, Phil. How are you doing? Hi, Irving. Thank you for calling me Flo. That's what everyone calls yeah, me. Yeah, well, <laughs> I'm sure they feel more comfortable that way. Fine. Uh, we want to know a lot more about you and and, uh, and so on. So we're, we're going to start at the beginning. I guess that's, that's where a good place is to start from. So uh, let, me think, let me ask you uh, where you were uh, born, where you came from, and so on. And go on from there. Well, I was born in Brooklyn, which is called the the country of Brooklyn, New York. Oh, yeah. Yes. Yeah. And um, actually, I've only written one play that's been produced by the theater club, but oh. I was very pleased with it. Yeah, that. we'll see some of that a little bit later, but I just wondered uh, how long you stayed in Brooklyn. Oh, I lived in Brooklyn till I was about 17 and a half, 18 years old. Yeah. Um, and then I moved to Queens, Woodside, Queens. Oh, that's and, also New York. Um, Right, that's yeah. also New York, yeah. until I was married, and then uh -huh. I moved to uh -huh. what they call um, Levittown. Did you ever hear of Levittown? No, I haven't heard Yes, it was a community of uh, houses, uh -huh. and uh, it was very interesting the way, for instance, the way uh, it was arranged. Uh, we'd have uh, a painter paint one door green, yeah. And go to the, go about five doors down, paint another one green. The mm. next painter would come along mm. and paint mm. uh, the next house yellow. And wow. five houses down, paint that house yellow. It's the same thing when they planted a tree. They would, um, someone would come and put the tree on the sidewalk. Someone else would come and dig a hole, mm -hmm. and someone else would come and put the tree in the hole mm -hmm. and water it. And so that's where I um, I lived for a long, long time. Yeah, fine. <laughs> uh, <coughs> how long did you stay out in New York? I moved to, to California in when I was about 25. About 25? Yes, oh. I had two children at that time. Oh, oh good. And you were married, had children. That's yes, good. I was married naturally, yeah, yes. Had, uh, had a boy. A boy, How? and um, okay. and a daughter. Yeah, and they are three years apart. Uh huh. Sounds, that sounds good. All right. Uh, and uh, then you uh, had, had to move to other places here in, in California. Uh, I was just wondering when you. Oh yes, I uh, I lived in um, Whittier yeah. for about twelve years, oh, maybe yeah. six. No, it was longer than that because we built a house in Whittier, uh -huh. and um, then we moved to, um, we moved to uh, your Belinda, mm -hmm. and then after that, my whole life changed. Oh, <laughs> in what way was that? Well, I, uh, our divorce started to come through, and then I went back to school and uh, became a psychiatric technician. Oh, really? And uh, did a lot of things. And yeah? Yeah. Psychiatric? You know. uh, psychiatric. T where was this? In some hospital? Maybe? Well, I worked, uh, I went to Mount San Antonio College yeah. for my uh, license as uh -huh. a psych tech. Uh -huh. And I worked at Lanterman Hospital, hospital which was... Um, a hospital for the developmentally disabled. Oh, it's yeah. a state-run hospital. Uh huh. And then I moved here, and I worked at Fairview State Hospital for about eight more years. 
So I'm what do you mean you moved years. here? Here in the Leisure World? To Leisure World. Oh, that's, mm -hmm. that's about when mm -hmm. you moved to the Leisure World. That's, uh, that's, that was my next question I was going to ask you. <laughs> when you came to the Leisure World and, and, and what you did uh, when you came here, I guess of you... Of course, there's a long span of time yeah, in between. Yeah, But you, uh, you found some interesting things to do here in Leisure World, uh, such as, as what? Such the as the theater club, the yeah. chorus, the... Uh, Since you wanted to be an actress, you, you found the theater club. That was great. The theater club has been wonderful to me. I've yeah. done a lot of work with uh -huh. a theater club, which I couldn't do outside because I don't drive as much anymore. Uh -huh. Did a lot of traveling before, mm -hmm. did a lot of work in Orange County acting, but when I came here, I wasn't ready to do all that all that traveling anymore. So this has been wonderful for me. Yeah, uh, same. They say it works out pretty much the same as with me. I, when I moved to Leisure World, I, I had already done a lot of work in Hollywood in front of the camera, and I always felt like uh, I wanted to work uh, in in the film industry here. So mm -hmm. I I joined the uh, uh, Video Producers Club, and, and I'm enjoying doing that too. And I'm I'm videotaping a lot of shows and putting mm -hmm. them on Seal Beach TV, and. Uh, we're enjoying that, but let's get back to you. And I was just wondering, uh, you you've done a lot of different kind of parts in mo in, in acting or whatever. And uh, I was just wondering, you you I, well, I was going to ask you. Uh, it might be a little touchy, but how tall are you? <laughs> oh my, <laughs> I'm. Uh, <laughs> I guess I'm shrinking in my age. Uh, yeah. But. Um, I uh, I'm about four nine and a quarter. <laughs> Shall I yeah. take every every inch I can get? Yeah, uh, and we'll it was a real problem to me when I was growing up, particularly for uh, for well, living, living, mm -hmm. uh, singing, mm -hmm. which is what I loved to do. I started singing when I was very young, mm -hmm. but I was always and probably still am. Uh, self-conscious about my height when it comes to singing. <laughs> With acting, I don't have to worry about that because I, I act as somebody else. Well, that's fine. You know, uh, we uh, talked about your being an actress now and uh, here at Leisure World and uh, and the theater club and so on. And I have a, a kind of a role in uh, it. Uh, it'll give us a little overall picture of of what kind of acting you do. And and it sounds it's, uh, I've done it's, I've seen you. You've done great. So I'd like to have the the role in played right now and and show people what um, what you look like and when you're acting. <laughs> Can well, we? I'm lucky. I um, I have a face that. Uh, that can do a lot of things, yeah. and I change. I can change in the spur of the moment. Uh huh. Mm -hmm. So fine. So Myra better five bucks that uh, I won't dance with her. And I bet you're wondering what Sarah's next move will be. I'm going to double it. Ten dollars says he will dance with me, and ten more says he will do it with pleasure. Go on. Big shot. A shot, huh? Oh, hello, you handsome creature. Did you hide me, Piccolo? Oh, no, Sarah, I'm sorry. What did you say? Forget it. Let's dance. I'm not in the mood. That's exactly why you should dance. It will put back the passion in your personness. Did I say that? Maybe later. Well, then of course I kiss as Rabin, and then as well. I will, sometime. They say, quote, there is no time like the present, unquote. So let's go. You said you only tell the truth, I mean the truth. Bye. 
How about that? that? Wasn't that wasn't that great, folks? I, 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 that, this is really just an example of what you've been doing in the in, in leisure world, and, uh, and it's great. I uh, go ahead. I'll tell you, I loved being Bloody Mary. I thought that was one of the greatest roles I'd uh, had. A very good casting there, because you really knew your part and they did very well. Yeah. Uh, I, uh, I think this, like I was just saying, this, this is one of, the, uh, one of the better parts that I've seen you. That's why I put it on here, but uh, it, was, it was just wonderful. I well, really I, enjoyed it. I started acting when I was, uh, let's see, it was in 69, uh, and I went back to school. I went to Fullerton College. Oh. I had a wonderful instructor. His uh -huh. name was Mr. Stilton. And one day, the first after the first piece that I had done for class, he tapped me on the shoulder. He very seldom gave compliments, and he commended me on my performance. Well, it was a piece that, that another girl and I had done. Yeah. And um, and after that, I played uh, roles of Queen Elizabeth uh, and the uh, the head of the department. Uh, came over to me and he said, I would never have known you were not five foot nine instead of <laughs> four foot. <laughs> yeah. And um, I found that in acting I could play almost anything. That's right. Uh, I'm looking forward to a dramatic role somewhere, somewhere. Oh, well, they'll but come the up. The theater huh? club has given me the opportunity to keep acting because now I don't drive as much as I used to. Oh, yeah? I don't like going into that traffic on the freeways. Yeah, right. You know, for a part. And though I'm not earning very much, I, I enjoy it. I enjoy it thoroughly. Oh, very good. And um, now they're, they've just done um, Tomorrow Waits, which... Yes. That, which was, that was, was probably one of the scenes yes. that you have. That it, it was the first straight play that I wrote. The first two plays were musicals, oh. and I wrote all the music for them. And I have them with my with my agent as well as Tomorrow Waits. And Tomorrow Waits is among the top ten in um, Wisconsin, I believe, in a theater group. So. Um, what did Wisconsin do? 
Uh, it's a theater. There's a theater in Wisconsin oh, that uh -huh. Tamara Waits is at, and also um, Autumn Promise, and for which I wrote uh, 25 songs, a lot of songs, too yeah, many songs. Yeah. But um, well, I see I'm you working with this agent, and he likes my newest play that I've written called uh, Doing Nothing. Oh, And well. it takes place in a... In a uh, psychiatric ward. But they do something on the, in the play, I'm sure. <laughs> yes, <laughs> they do they something, do and that's why it's called <laughs> saying, doing nothing. Doing and they right. keep saying, oh, uh, it's nothing. We did nothing. Uh -huh. Oh, yeah. yeah. I see. Yeah. yeah. Uh, that's what, uh, 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 what, what did your father and the, the mother think about your acting? Uh, did well, did they say My that? father would have loved it. Yeah. He used to make believe he was drunk. It was a, 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 a way of of getting attention, you know, uh -huh. of being able to sit on my aunt's laps, oh. and, uh, laps and, and, and so forth and so on. Of course, he never really was drunk, but he'd make believe, and he uh, he liked. Uh, he liked acting. He liked to make believe. He was he did, yeah, he, he would have loved this. He might have been. He acting. would have loved it. Yeah. And so I just wrote a poem yeah. uh, about my using my maiden name, and that's in honor of my father oh, yeah. that I used my maiden name. Oh, that was nice. Yeah. My mother, on the other hand, was a very realistic, realistic, feet on the ground sort of person. Yeah. And theater arts was not. One of the things that you do, yeah. you know, that you did at that time, yeah. at any rate. Um, a lot of people thought maybe but you know, actors. When I became a psychiatric technician, yeah. of course, this had a lot to do with medicine as well. And we True. cared for not only the uh, developmentally disabled and the emotionally uh, ill, but also the physically ill. And I took care of her when she had cancer. And she told me I was one of the best nurses she had ever had. Oh, there so that you was go. Quite a, yeah, very yeah, good. So that was quite a Very good. Yeah. Uh, well that was uh, that, that's interesting to know your, some of your background, you know, of how your parents might feel about it. Because uh, a lot of people think, well, acting, that's, uh, mm -hmm. You never well, make a living at it. Uh, that's right. Go well, do, I go never do, really do. Go get a job and something, you know. <laughs> Even when I was supposed to make a living at it, or at least earn something, yeah. there was always a reason why the company didn't have enough money or <laughs> something of that nature. Yeah, right, right. Uh, so uh, what are, you got? You got any? You got any future plans here? I mean, you're living in a leisure world, and, and well. I just got an agent last year. Oh, good. And he has all my works, and he likes them so far. They're your plays, yeah. Mm, he likes game. my yeah. plays, and uh -huh. he's sending them out. Yeah. Uh -huh. And who knows? Who knows? Something might come who out knows? of that. That's right. That's <laughs> Life right. is exciting. You have to uh, keep hoping. Yeah. Uh, well, it's my, it's my belief that everyone has a talent to be used and to be able to put a little pinpoint right. to yes. make someone else happy. So you're, so you're still to search for it. You're still uh, uh, doing professional work, and uh, I've done a couple of commercials. I did a commercial for Lifeline. Oh, wow. Well. You know, that little piece that, uh, oh, that oh, the yes, senior yes. citizens wear. A very popular in leisure work. Yes, That's yes. Right. So I did that, and I did commercial for Save On, and uh, it was in on the front page of their, of their oh, uh, yeah. advertising uh, uh, classified section. Yeah, uh-huh. Mm -hmm. Oh, yeah, it's, it's, it's right. com commercial, too. That's very, that's good. Uh, I don't like not traveling anymore. They're not, yeah, I know. <laughs> well, traveling all the way into Hollywood now is, right. it, uh, on, the, on the freeway is it, quite a de deal. Because Last uh, time I, I went for an audition, I came, and I couldn't find the place, and I was a mess. Oh, yeah. So yeah. I, I don't like the traveling You try anymore. to be on time, and then when you get to Hollywood, you, like you have to look for a, a place to park, and then, uh, and you're thinking about what you're going to be doing, and, and you've got a lot of things to think about. But anyway, I know I know how I know you I've, you did a lot of that. I've did I've done a lot of that too. Mm -hmm. I've, I've done an awful lot of auditions and got a lot of commercials and uh, I in, saw in a few movies things. too. I saw a few things you did and oh they were very good. Yeah, thank you. Yes, uh -huh. you had a program here in Leisure World. 
oh, on, yeah? on Comcast. Well, I, I do. A, I do a lot of. Yeah, I do a lot of mm -hmm. uh, taping uh, of different programs. I try to do a, uh, a lot of interesting things. Put them on Channel Three right here in, mm -hmm. in, in Seal Beach TV. Yeah. So yes, I I, I like uh, like mm -hmm. doing what I'm doing, and you like what you're doing. Yeah. And uh, I went to a school in uh, in Hollywood for acting. Yeah. And uh, I didn't like it at all. Every time they got a new uh, a new instructor, we would practice something for the next class. Yeah. And he was gone. Yeah. He was fired. Yeah. Uh, but I did get a. Um, I did get a um, a six months um, uh, uh, what what's it um, well six months I take lessons without any charge. Oh because yeah, well that's good. They thought I was good. Sorry. You know it's uh, it's been real f a lot of fun talking to you. I'm real happy that you came t to to be our guest today. And uh, it looks like we're running out of time, so <laughs> so well, I, thank I wish you. I could go, on, go on for thank a while. Thank you so longer. much for inviting Oops, me. That's I all right. really appreciate it. That's all right. I think that was, you you were a very interesting guest, and it was very very good. Thanks so we'll we'll be uh, uh, thanking thanking the uh, people that that uh, helped make this show, the whole crew. We are also thanking uh, Dick Davies, our president, and his wife Susan for feeding uh, the crew and and ourselves. And, and so uh, we're, we're, we're uh, having a lot of fun doing this show. So uh, 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 